Oh, this 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 bulge here that I that I had. Huh, it it is much much much. I I cannot even explain how much better this is for me in terms of health. This became for me the unimaginable. I avoided very very close call again. Um, for the last six months, uh, the pain was becoming unbearable, not because it would be very, very, very painful, but because it was steady. Uh, it uh, spread through this entire area here. Uh, it somewhat... Uh, inflammated this area to the degree that I would not even that it kind of felt me like it's it's kind of paralyzed this area here even the entire area I'm talking about all this here like this all the way to here down like this it became inflammated and it was a lymph node that did this stuff uh, because the pain was persistent 24-7. Uh, the worst thing even happened when I would go sleep and it would be the only time when I would not feel that I have this shit here and, uh, you know, would wake up to feel even worse uh, pain. It's gone. It's gone. The way I avoided this on a, uh, uh, what I already considered as unavoidable was by simply wearing uh, uh, cotton, uh, it's actually long underwear around my neck. You know, I would wrap myself with underwear as hot as it was around my neck. First, I did during the sleep, and the only thing that would happen is uh, my back, uh, my shirt turned shirt. I was not wrapping the shirt or anything like this, but shirt was totally hot, uh, like a puddle. Like you, I would have a, like a puddle of the water, night after night after night after night, and gradually, the first thing that happened was pain was gone and then what it happened was uh, it started to grow smaller and smaller and smaller uh, it's it's still there but this is somewhere in a perimeter of the normal size uh, more or less I would even go when I would go for a walk uh, I would start to use in a hot weather I would start to use this long underwear cotton uh, because it's not synthetic it's a hundred percent cotton and uh, like this it gave me a chance to nicely uh, isolate cold from this area here uh, from the right side lymph node with which they were playing with already since 1998 again talking about Milan Kuchan here uh, playing with the lymph nodes since 1998. This stuff here, this one, the Rinan since 1998. I remember this stuff. And this is how I probably avoided the unavoidable. Americans told me that after, if it persists for like pain, if it persists for six months, you're due 100%, you're due to surgery. And it's probably in a last second that I avoided. Americans also told me that the, they're going to see me on the computer when I will be talking physicians, doctors, that, and that this thing will grow and grow and grow and grow. It will become bigger and bigger, but it didn't. Uh, this lymph node, it, it, it still, uh, it, it deflated itself 
and uh, it's somewhat now normal size and the pain is gone even so uh, it kind of feels like again completely normal so this is how I did this one so this is another one I managed to avoid secret medication night after night uh, for one week I would be waking up on my back it was completely wet my chest completely completely wet and of course uh, this thing was totally wet as well so this is how I did this one so this is what this was Uh, I did not properly finish this video about lymph node. This shit have gone as far as Prince Charles, now King Charles, explaining me. Uh, it was first the police and then it was King Charles also who was explaining me that I am not to use the shavers like a manual shavers but only a clippers to trim my beard uh, guaranteed me that this is okay this is very very uh, it, it, it cuts very very short and that i should be okay with this stuff um and in fact that is my using uh uh, razor blades, you know, razor blades. I'm using the razor blades to cut my, uh, to trim myself, to cut, to clean, to shave myself. Uh, that are causing this stuff, which is absolutely not true. They were causing this stuff during MK Ultra, talking about the police. First, it was the police investigators that investigated, in particular, who met me in 2022 at a police station, who insisted that uh, I am not allowed to use shave, uh, razor blades anymore uh, and began to insist on this issue and then it was even uh, Prince Charles who started to insist me that I must use that trimmer no more uh, a shaving blade to even shave myself so hooray uh, this was a knowledge is the deadliest issue of mine I think I have more problems uh, but this is another one I survived so that makes me also feel good I know how to treat this that one enough to oh uh, Prince Charles claimed that this is not a cancer this is also interesting I also managed to pull that out uh, he claimed me with the police at the end at the final stage they told me in 2020 whatever laughing at me that this is an infection so they were playing with infections they were playing with infections this is just an infection i don't know if just the stuff that i described to you when you get even paralyzed sort of when you start to not even to feel the area here uh where it's so painful inflammated and it doesn't restrict itself anymore to the lymph node but you start to feel all the way to here, this, this whole area here, this is not just, this is a serious business. It's a very serious business. Uh, they told me six months, the police suggested me even three months, uh, entire novel master hospital, general hospital novel master was involved in this stuff. Yeah, for, this doesn't go to 98, uh, this shit goes earlier time right now when I thought about the hospital stuff uh, pertaining to this stuff here they insisted they're gonna save me in a style like only I can save you surgeons from General Hospital Novo Mesto uh, they were familiarizing themselves and I and continue to infect this lymph node here so that they could save me uh, you're talking about 1996 concerning the physicians from the hospital, Novo Mesto and also Ljubljana. Physician from Novo Mesto learned about this stuff in 96, 97. He still works at the Novo Mesto hospital.
a police investigator who was in a, such a good humor about the cancer uh, pertaining to this lymph node, a really, really funny guy, a really, really humorous. They were laughing about this stuff in like a really, really jolly spirit uh, during MK Ultra, so it was. Uh, insisted me in front of Prince Charles that this is this is a bait of the vampire. You know, Charles is into a vampires. He is into he is a relative of Dracula. Uh, so that this is a kiss of the of the vampire here. Yeah, that this is why this is, and it was all the time about. We did this um, because one time I talked about, I understand, so that's what they claim about the decapitate, whatever. Decapitate issues was the police that all the time talked about during MK Ultra. All the time, decapitate, decapitate. And I probably did mention stuff like this on my website and they told me we did this to you because you talk about decapitate oh that shit was done no worries that stuff was done already before the 1996 milan kuchan knows all about it how it was done and so according to the novel mr police a kiss of the vampire maybe that was not even charles that would be interesting to know what he has to say about that one but there's one thing I have to tell you, Charles. Uh, this police investigators, if you think you're going to bail them out, if you think you're going to get them out, whatever deal you have made with them, because it was all about making deals, forget it. You are going to be the next one if you're going to come close to this issue pertaining to the police investigators. And I'm not decided on your fate yet because you did very very poorly you did extremely extremely poorly you assisted them in bad stuff so far you have not accomplished for me absolutely anything so if you're going to get into this stuff something benefiting them something trying to bail them out in absolutely any way you're going to be next there was enormous enormous uh, police obsession with Hey, this is a black t-shirt and then this here this is a red t-shirt there was enormous enormous obsession during MK Ultra about my wearing something like this that's basically black t-shirt with uh, what would look out uh, red sleeves uh, and my mama made sure even the other day when I had it at the police station the the t-shirt that was like this a regular t-shirt uh, disappeared she is the one playing with hiding clothing hiding socks hiding shirts uh, simply hiding the stuff and uh, made sure that instead I would have this one here with a collar which I did use when I headed the police station to file the complaint about the ticket, about the right hand ticket. Uh, police obsession with these shirts, with this style of dressing myself, uh, comparing me with a Dracula, with a vampire, uh, comparing me. Uh, claiming me that whoever I would mention uh, would uh, be as if Komodo Dragon would bite him. Slovenian police novel Mesto police investigators were obsessed with the Komodo Dragons during their trips to, uh, I don't know, Indonesia or I don't know what a country were. Um, It's part of, uh, it's in the area, it's, I think it's a, 
I'm trying to the big island that is um, that is located not to also too far from Singapore, but there is a, not Jakarta is another is another big island uh, in the area right there, and there are comoda dragons over there. And Novo Mesto police was just completely overtaken by these Komodo dragons. And they compared me with the Komodo dragons. Basically, whoever I would mention, it would be like a bite of the Komodo dragon. It would be like uh, the, uh, the, that, uh, uh, you know, a prey from the Komodo dragon, which bites first, paralyzes one through the blood clots started to create an eventually an animal actually no it's something else that it does it red tunic or it makes the uh, the blood less thick or something like this so until the the animal is completely paralyzed and uh, you know it eats it, one entirely um and the next to it they will compare me with all the time they were comparing me with a Dracula, Dracula, Dracula. Uh, the hiking which went on always was at nights. I was the one who I learned to drink the water from the graveyards because of them. But that's one thing I have to tell that uh, during the hiking trails, during the hiking and stuff like this, I learned to drink the water because of them, because they teach me that the graveyard is always open and if you're thirsty you go and you get yourself with a bottle of water, you get to drink. Uh, well, however, the violence, the police violence, the mother's violence that she imposed on me, my parents, what they were doing at home, forced me into isolated life. Uh, so that I could at least somewhat complete my projects, continue to do my stuff. That basically pushed me away from nights, from the normal, uh, from a, from the normal life cycle. So this is how that status was, and this police status was further uh, subject to the problems which they promised me during MK Ultra, so that you're going to fit. It's really sadistically about this novel master police. Uh, they also celebrated the injury of the kidney and of the liver, which would greatly reduce your sleeping patterns. This is what the psychiatrist Koch wanted this way. He was creating his own kind of pathos. So did you understand that this is the word about the beasts? The other day, the police officer stated to me that he's a police officer over there at the police station when he was involved in a lot of bad stuff. And when I reappeared at the police station to suggest that he directly was involved in the right turn, semaphore light crime, he asked me if I need maybe a mental health, uh, if I need medical health assistance and so on. Um, directed straight into causing injury on the liver and on a kidney the liver damage initially when i go back in time the way they did the liver damage was with enormous amounts of salt is what they used this is i don't understand why the fuck i forgot all about it but it was all at the beginning of mk Ultra when they started to indoctrinate me that you're not supposed to eat salty food and I told you, yeah, you can, salt, you can salty food. But the thing is, the same thing as it happened with feet, where they were doing the damage that I explained along the river, the same thing they were using with uh, ink from the pens is exactly what they have used initially at the beginning. Like I said, they always do the damage at the start. They make themselves enormous advantage at the start. And so they made me eat enormous amount of salt, salted food. This is how they created initially the damage with a kidneys and probably liver also. So this is the, the toy about the Dracula. And it was this criminal who met me at the police station. 
Mr. Chernila, Mr. Chernila, who stated he also had a problem with this red and black shirt uh, that he was going to make sure, in fact, that with the day when I would be going at the police station, I would not have this kind of shirt. If you somehow will manage, you will never manage to this stage. But if you will manage to this stage to even lounge complain against us for uh, not for MK Ultra, it was meant for MK Ultra, and obviously for the right turn on a semaphore light, I will make sure that you will not have the shirt. It was the mother who made sure that this shirt, uh, a regular T-shirt, therefore, would disappear, and also make sure that the few days earlier. Actually, maybe a month too earlier, it would be the shirt with a collar that would appear, which I never really used, but it was the only one red one. So this is the way they operated. This is the way they operate. So for them, all this stuff, Dracula, vampire, cancer, uh, kidney, liver, stuff like this, all this stuff, torture, uh, uh, Violence stalking is completely, this is the way, this is a normal way, this, this is all the police, this is the way they do it, yes, this is how they do it, the normal way, this is the normal way, this is the way it's done. This is, uh, the, this is uh, uh, obviously how they prove the mental illness, this is how the people approved being mentally ill. Um, There is certain issues I am not going to even mention uh, that came from abroad because people learn about this, people find out about this. Um, there were some people that were extremely, extremely disturbed with this type of attitude. Uh, I was more disturbed with the fact that nobody had done anything about it. But maybe now, when I stress all these issues, uh, maybe people will do something about it. Maybe something will be done against. Uh, this is this is not human being. This is this is swines. These are not swines. These are not human beings. This is basically people who enjoy killing. It's one thing. This is this is one thing. Americans yeah. talk to me about. Uh, uh, they did not even understand what what this is, but. Uh, they went on to portray me like they're doing something deliberately and then they demanded for me to complain about them and stuff like this because they were white and so on. It had no logic in it. There was no way, there was no element in it I'm talking about. The stuff I'm talking about, it's, this is like a ritual. This is the stuff I'm talking about, this is like a celebration, like a fucking happiness. It's like immeasurable happiness these people were experiencing when they tortured so that i don't i don't you don't most of the people that don't know what what kind of stuff this is about what kind of people these are they're unfortunately these are people i have to regard them as a people i even have to regard them as a police officers when i go to the police station but this is the circumstances basically you know that's why i got so angry that you know i i i just i got forced to to, to, to work under this kind of circumstance or with this kind of... It's not even a scum. It's not even a swine. 